Good morning and welcome to the official formal ribbon cutting of New Little Branches presents Lanza Learning Center. Yeah. 13 years ago, Anna Brokwa opened New Little Branches Daycare with the hope of providing the valuable service of child care and early child care education for working families in the Yonkers community. She made it look easy. It was anything but. No one knew that for 13 years, Anne used her entire pension, savings, and faith to keep the doors of new little branches open. With her savings and pension depleted after almost 13 years of doing this, am I right, Anne? Faith is what kept these doors open. And literally, she was months away from having to make a hard decision that maybe I just might have to close the doors of New Little Branches Daycare. But what happened at that time is, in walks Pat Lanza. <laughs> Mrs. Patricia Lanza was a dream maker. How could Ann know that this modest woman has changed the lives of thousands of people all over the world by making dreams come true? Anne had nothing but her faith to lean on when God brought Mrs. Lanza through these doors. The next morning, Mrs. Lanza called to tell me she had met this wonderful woman in a struggling daycare in Yonkers. And I'll never forget that she told me she was moved to tears as she saw all those beautiful children. She said, I want to help her, that's Pat. I want to help her and those children. In the next breath, she said, didn't you say you were taking some early, you know, child care classes? <laughs> As Ray mentioned, I did what I could do. I gave what I had. And it was for the purpose of the children, the community. They became my life. They continue to be my life. I just want to thank Ms. Lanza for coming through the doors. Her mission wasn't mine when she came through the door but it became mine. And so it's time to let go. And so when she brought Ray in, <laughs> as it turned out, they're completing my journey. Yes. Yes. And it's for the same purpose. Yes. The children. Yes. Uh, if I don't give speeches, I give money. <laughs> also, some of the areas that we've consistently struggled in in the early childhood field to really provide children with great experiences, uh, learning experiences in the areas of math and technology and science, really trying to make those areas be as much in the forefront as some of the other things that we've done in the past. So I see myself and I fall down and really getting involved in the scientific experiences and we're excited to see the growth and we are also getting a lot of kudos from people in the in the early childhood field for being able to incorporate that. So our vision is that we're going to be the gold standard of early childhood education. I think what we're doing is something unknown to daycares um, nowadays. I think we're really trying to bring the rigor um, and the fun to uh, to an early childhood facility and bringing science to part of daycare, you don't usually find that into a grade school and bringing technology into a daycare facility and you don't usually find that. I think this is truly a learning center versus a daycare center. I'm good. I'm very excited today seeing this come to a, a the beginning, the beginning of a new era. It's been a lot of fun and uh, Ray and the staff have worked so hard to get everything up to where it should be and it, it's just terrific that it's all turning out so I'm so glad. <laughs> I didn't know what to expect because I've never really been involved in daycare. Mine was always in scholarships for uh, high school students so coming down to this age is completely different but I love it, love it. But I can just recall one moment when I knew that a change had come and that's when I saw the smart board in my three-year-old daughter's class. And that's when I started to see them using iPads and I started to see, see her coming home with more structure. Okay. I see a, a, a huge difference in JL, especially uh, when it comes to uh, the curriculum. She knows her numbers, she can write her name, she knows not only the letters of the alphabet, 
but she understands the sounds of the letters of the alphabet. Tons of things in science. She she understands the galaxy. She was talking about the stars and the moon the other day. It was wonderful.